Hi, I'm Jody Fitz. Welcome into the Price Chopper Kids Cooking Club Kitchen where we're getting ready for a little bit of Easter fun. And I have a friend who's here to help me get things going. Can you tell everybody your name? Micah. Micah. Micah and I are going to color some Easter eggs. What do you think? Is that good? Yeah. Yeah. Do you like to color Easter eggs? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Me too. All right, Mr. Micah, we're going to show everybody how we're going to put this together. We made a little bit of food coloring fun, right? So I'm going to give you this. Can you hold on to the measuring spoon for me? We're going to fill it up with a teaspoon of vinegar. Go ahead and pour that in. And then you can take the water and pour that right on top of our vinegar. And now we're going to add a little yellow food coloring. I'm only putting in about 10 drops because I want them to be a light base. But if you want them darker, go ahead and add a little bit more, like up to 20. But the reason we're doing them light is because that's only step one. And then we're going to keep going with step two to add that darker color on top. Go ahead and take that egg, place it right inside the yellow for me. Grab that paper towel for me and catch this egg. And then we're going to pat it dry so that we can speed things up today. Go ahead, pat it dry with the paper towel. And now, Micah, I found these great eggs. They're very inexpensive. You can open them up. And guess what I put in here? Rice. That's right. I grabbed the minute rice right from Price Chopper. I use the Price Chopper brand. And so I've got one here that I'm going to have you help me get prepared to show everybody how to do this. So it's about two tablespoons of the minute rice to one teaspoon of food coloring. All right, so go ahead and pour that one in. And we're going to stir that rice all up until it's all nice and yellow. All right, fantastic. What's your favorite? Blue. Blue? All right, blue it is. All right, there you go. We're going to put it in here. We're going to close it up. Can you hold on to that egg for me? Make sure we have it closed. We're going to have a little Easter fun. We're going to shake, rattle, and roll. Go ahead and shake it all around. Make sure you get it so that it's all getting on there. <laughs> oh, look. How does yours look? Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Good. He likes it. Do you want to keep shake, rattling, and rolling? Yeah. Yeah? All right. So, tell everybody out there, say have a happy Easter. Have a happy Easter. And we hope you try this quick trick at home. Now stay tuned because we have two recipes we want to share.